In the container, we have a bag with a dilute hydrochloric acid solution. Take out the bag and cut it open. Pour its contents into the plastic container and cover the container. This solution can be stored and reused many times. Examine the apparatus. It has an electric motor from which there extends one red electric wire connected to the copper electrode and a second black wire attached to an alligator clip. This apparatus does not have a battery. There are several coiled magnesium strips in another bag. Take one. Put it through the round hole in the apparatus and secure it firmly with the alligator clip. It should be parallel to the copper electrode. Make sure the alligator clip is tightly fastened to the magnesium strip. Now, replace the transparent cover by first fastening it on the side with a propeller and then pressing the other end. You are now ready to perform the experiment. Open the container with hydrochloric acid and dip only the copper electrode into the solution. Notice that a few bubbles form and that the copper electrode turns a slightly brighter color. The motor, however, does not turn. Now, dip only the magnesium coil into the solution and observe a strong reaction, followed by the appearance of bubbles. However, once again, the motor does not turn. Only when both electrodes are simultaneously dipped into the acid do we observe that the propeller rotates, indicating that an electric current is flowing in the circuit. The deeper we immerse the electrodes into the solution, the faster the propeller turns. Eventually, the magnesium will be consumed and the propeller will stop turning. After you have finished the experiment, remove the excess magnesium from the alligator clip. Clean and dry the other electrode for future use.